Oli Arblaster, the 19-year-old on whom so much potential is obvious, gets the game underway. The referee, Tim Robinson, is uh, just having a word with Andreas Pereira as our blaster floats this one to the edge of the penalty area. Flicked on by McBurney, oh. Diaz is underneath it! And now Alex Iwobi cuts him from the near side, the right. Shuffles the ball into the feet of Pereira, who keeps it moving. Opportunity for Robinson! Pereira takes a free kick, chipping it uh, towards Adara Bayoyo, who wins the knockdown of the dead ball line. McBurney beaten to it. Osborne then clears outside of the penalty area. Then Iwobi shoots. Shot takes a massive deflection. Castagna bends in the cross, takes a flick on the way through. Bogle did well to deal with the bouncing ball, with Iwobi getting the win, and now Willian bends it in. Vinny Souza with a good diving header away. It will be everywhere at the moment. Glorious diagonal ball into the penalty area. It was there for Castagna to chase. Robinson steps up. Long throw in into the penalty area. Leno comes with the one-fisted punch. Away it goes from uh, Rodrigo Muniz. Cleared away. Harmer tries to keep it alive. Flicked on by Ahmed Hodzic. In comes the cross from Willian. Into the uh, feet of Rodrigo Muniz, who picks out uh, João Paulinho. Yeah. Osborne's free kick comes in, headed towards goal, but it's tame. Ball thrown into the box, headed towards goal. Well, it goes on a run, plays it through to Moniz. Oh, oh, good little bit of touch. play, and it's toe poked towards goal by a defender, it's off the post. Ball forward for Sheffield United over to the right, shot Ooh. from a difficult angle. So here comes the free kick from the left. Pereira plays it in, Ahmed Odzic heads clear. It will be back in there, but it's catching practice. Ben Osborne will take on the right-hand side. Swung in, McBurney goes up for it, it was just flicked away by a defender. United will keep it in with Hamer, he gets his cross in, it's a poor cross, only cleared to the edge of the box in our blast, a great footwork from him. Holds on to it, now plays it to the edge of the area in Hamer, he's urged to shoot, beats one man, kills it towards goal, but whips it wide of the uh, left-hand post. It's just going to go on one last dart here is William, and then... Uh, there's the half-time whistle from the referee as the ball goes out of play. Rodrigo Muniz in his uh, dark grey shirt with the uh, salmon pink shorts and socks gets us moving with Fulham in this second half playing from right to left. It uh, might not be too long before we see a substitution as Muniz attacking down the far side which is their right corner from Pereira as it comes in and is volleyed by Rodrigo Muniz. Pereira once again, three Brazil caps to his name now after the international break. Need away by Sousa and now the counter-attack begins, slaloming up the pitch. Come uh, Sheffield United, albeit only temporarily, into the box goes the cross, Muniz off the bar! Eight for the season, the uh, Brazilian seven in seven prior to the break, and now here is Diaz. Diaz chipping in the cross, oh. they're queuing up. McBurney was shaping to shoot, but a defender, Sasa Lukic, dangled his leg in the way. They're now battling for it at the dead ball line. Right. Officials have a call to make, it's play on. Out it comes to Arblaster, corner of the penalty area, deep cross too high, just inches too high for Diaz. Now the uh, Fulham side come forward again, it will be first time cross right footed, Pereira jumping but he won't get there, Ackman oh, Hodges glances it away but Souza slowed down, gifting possession back to Willian, back to Pereira the diagonal ball back to Willian oh. they're queuing up here, then the block Pereira bends in the corner, scissor kick clearance away by McBurney, only as far as he will be, who's 25 yards out, left-footed strike onto the head of Vinny Souza, now the chase is on, Brereton Diaz is beaten to it by Anthony Robinson, we saw in the first half how rapid he was, Fulham have the ball back, starting to look ominous at the start of this second half, which is seven minutes old, in goes the cross, bent high this time, the corner from Pereira, Adara Bayoyo's downward header, now Willian gets it back once again, diagonal ball into the box, Here's Anthony Robinson crossing, shooting Chancey Wobey, beats the first man, quick feet, then they're back. Pereira lifts his left hand from the right-hand corner, in it goes into the box. A blade, Robinson ends up flat on his back, little deft touch to pick out Muniz, who skies a diagonal ball forward, there for Alex Iwobi to chase, he will get there. Stutter step runner from Pereira, in it goes, curled to the edge of the penalty area. Castagna gets a little caught in the sunshine and can only really go back to Bernd Leno, the goalkeeper who's a long way out of his penalty area and then Fulham concede possession and it's Osborne, out to McBurney, left channel of the box, Diaz! Scores for Sheffield United as Ben Brereton Diaz side foots home first time at the
the Brummer Lane Cup end. They've not created much, but he finished that with a plum. Brilliant finish. Willian on the near side, the mercurial Brazilian. Right footed in swinging cross, telling header, the glancing touch from Robinson. 61 gone, the Pereira corner, flat and an equaliser right onto the head of Xiao Paulinho, who didn't even have to move his feet to glance a header past a stranded Ivo Gerbic. Well, the lead was nice while it lasted. Diaz from a lucky break in behind Diaz. Left footed, gets decent height on it. McBurney tries to crash onto the header, but it's beaten to it by Pereira and Co. Out it comes to the edge of the box where Harmer takes the shot to nothing on the edge of the penalty area. Vinny Souza goes after it, gets a big shoulder. Robinson to Arblast, Fulham chase. Through it goes then to Harmer. Blades get a free kick. Sheffield United 1-1, one, one, free kick taken one. quickly. Brereton Diaz pulls it back. Yeah! And Oli McBurney has scored to restore Sheffield United's lead. Brereton Diaz repays the favour from the first goal. And he slips it McBurney. He taps home in front of the cop. And the Blades lead. Sheffield United 2, Fulham 1. United's fans and their manager just wanted to see them stay in the game and have a go and that is what's happened today look at that bit of skill from our blaster superb to find McBurney can United get a third here it's whipped in towards Brereton yes! Diaz he has got a third Sheffield United make it 3-1 it's a wonderful piece of football and as the players battle on the goal line this one isn't going to be disallowed as Brereton Diaz celebrates Blaster started it out to the left. The cross was inch perfect, and Brereton Diaz headed home. And Sheffield United have a 3 1 lead. Cross comes in here. Gerbic gets a punch and it comes to the edge of the box. Fulham with a chance to get one back, but a shot from Palinha that's, uh, that's always going wide. And now McBurney. McBurney over towards the left. This has been a Sheffield United second half performance as the ball is moved towards McBurney. Brereton okay. Diaz says, Play it, but. McBurney just couldn't quite get to the ball in time for that to happen. In towards Osborne, instead he's nudged over, that's a foul. Ref spotted it. Free kick lifted in, headed into the air by a Fulham defender. Back into the box, only half cleared. McBurney's shot deflected. McBurney again! Yeah! McBurney gets his second! Sheffield United are running right to the lane! Have they disallowed it? They have disallowed it. So Vinnie Souza is offside. Kenny gets away from his man, played to the edge of the box, shot driven in from the edge of the area, oh it's a fantastic finish, it's a great hit from Bobby de Cordova Reed, and just like that Sheffield United thought they were 4-1 up, and within seconds it is now 3-2 and game on with four minutes to go, Blades 3, Fulham 2. Osborne will clip this in, it's headed into the air by Fulham, Brereton Diaz is there, Traore on the right, cuts inside, he's going to shoot! Oh, 14 oh. minutes of stoppage time. Traore goes on the outside, cross comes in, it's gone behind for a corner. As the cross comes in, kicked away by United in the area. Shot driven back in, oh, it was an awkward one. Traore holds it up, he's got men in the middle for the cross, the cross is deflected behind off a defender. Corner from the right-hand side, whipped into the near post, there was another unmarked defender. It was Bassey, but he's just glanced it away from the area. Now Willian, Willian towards Traore. They're going to stand off him here because of the pace. Cross comes in, oh, it was a shot from the knees! He's done it again! Eight goals in eight games, and Sheffield United cruelly look as if they're going to be denied a victory here at Bramall Lane. They were 3-1 up, but two late goals from Fulham, and just like that, it's Blades 3, Fulham 3. Got Traore there, they're just feeding him the ball, looking for him for inspiration. On this right-hand side, he's going to try and go past his man, he's going to win a corner here as he drills it in. Here comes the corner from the right. Out swinger, headed towards goal by Meniz. We've had the 14 minutes of stoppage time. We're now into extra, extra time. Willian's pass, Robinson goes on a run, it's a foul, right on the edge of the box. Last opportunity for Fulham to snatch a win. Willian's ball, oh it's a lovely set piece, it's driven in, it's straight at oh. Gerbic. What a chance, and there is the full-time whistle. Players sink to the turf with cramp.